So Navratri is a big preparation. We have to know that the knowledge of Sahaja Yoga has to come to us. Otherwise, why will people ask, uh, think that you are saying? <coughs> Nobody is going to believe you that you are saying in your behavior, in your knowledge, in your dealings with others. Everything a Sahaja Yoga should be something outstanding. When I said, we have become, you all have to become your own masters. Then they use it the other way around. They tell the leader, now we have become our own masters. Mm. It's not the way. So first thing is wisdom. Wisdom, understand that we are said. Assume the power. Sometimes I feel as if a beggar is made a king, suppose. Still he doesn't assume his position. Anybody coming, he says, can you give me one penny? Though he's a king. Something like that. Now you have become the leaders of the world, all over the world. And this is something to be assumed and felt. It's not ego, it's reality. Because once you know that it is reality, you immediately change yourself. Immediately, you will think that, now what are we doing? How much do we know? We have the leaders, the responsibility of ours. If that is understood, you will be surprised that nothing is needed to work out your cleanse life. Just automatically it will work. That's my blessing to you. But you must feel that I have to be all right. You have to feel. <coughs> the situation becomes helpless for me sometimes. If I tell something to somebody, they start crying or they run away from surgery. So what am I to do? Should I leave you at the same stage as it is? Now to save you from evil is not the same as to fight Mahishasura or Narakasura, not that. The Narakurasura has also gone to your head and Mahishasura has also gone to your head. So the only thing one has to do is to understand there is this one in me. I'll ask that to get up. Once you work it out that way, you are doing Navratri itself. You have got powers, you have knowledge, you know, you can feel it. Just take out all these conditions. We are something different. We are not ordinary people. We are something very special. And why should we at all behave like others, or like the way others behave? No, not necessary. And what a big thing you have, what a big knowledge you have. Look at Christ, He was alone. He talked what He wanted to say to multitudes. He talked. He was crucified. Still He talked. Till the end. But He was knowledgeable. And you might say that Mother, He was an incarnation, all that. But in no way you are less now. You know how to raise the Kundalini, you know everything. You are My children. So I would suggest that to develop wisdom, you must meditate and be in the center. So all these things will go away. Just be away from this nonsense. In what atmosphere we live, what we do, it's not important. We have to know that we are something exceptional. All the ganas, all the angels are just waiting.